table, you can see that I got the shape of the head. I haven't put the eyes in, I put the nostrils in. I think this has to be a little rounder. And when you look at it from all angles, you want it to be proportionate, like here and here. I can see that that needs where the eye comes down. And I'm looking at it from the top. Let's poke this part in. Okay, this still needs a lot of work. And also, I don't want his head to be floppy. So you really gotta make this dense. Really compact the wool. All right, but what I was gonna show you is uh, this mane. And I was gonna take some of my brown. And I think I'm gonna take some of this orange. put it in my corridor here. Let's get that in there. Hold it like this and like that. Hold it this way. And it's blending the colors, okay. I think I want more orange. Lay that in there. Hold it like that. See if that's the color you want. I might be able to live with that. Do it one more time. Okay. So then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this. Take about half of it. Fold it over, and I'm gonna cut it. Like that. And then what I wanna do <laughs> is lay this on here. And then, you go right down the center. It's kind of hard to go right down the center. Right? And then I'm going to pull it this way and go down in here like this. Let's poke that in like that. A lot more poking than uh, what I'm showing you. You want to make sure that it doesn't come out. And I would continue to do this all the way down the back of the neck. And this way you get mixed color. Now see, I think there might be too much orange there. I can always go back and add the brown.
the idea is to get the hair to stand up. And to look like a giraffe mane. So, like that. So let me show you that one more time. I still have uh, this half left. So what did I do? I cut the ends off. Right? And then I want to see if the hair is going this way. It's not going to work. So you got to do it across. You know what I'm saying? What do I do with my needle? There it is. Let's try to stay in the middle. Really poke that in there. Feel it's nice and secure. Then you can start to turn it on its side and poke that part in. Keep in mind the shape of your giraffe as you're poking. All right, see this has to be smoothed out. And then do the other side. that down in there like that. Now mix more color and go down the whole neck. All right. So you want to pull on it to see, you know, if anything's coming out. See here is a little short, so I'll probably add more in there. That's no big deal. Let's just make sure it's all tight in there. You see, he's rather lumpy. You can see his face. Okay. The side of his face. This side. It's coming along, but it still needs a lot of work. And this neck, I want to make that look nice. Okay. So that's giraffe mane. Mixing color. And uh, making it stand up. 